My name is Raymond Braun, and I'm from a small town in Ohio. When I say that I didn't know how to go into the closet, I think this demonstrates that. I mean, hello. <laughs> Since Stonewall, Pride has been a looking glass into the entire LGBTQ community. So I want to know what it means to young people today. One, two, three, Pride! I decided to take a road trip to big cities and small towns across the country. The first couple years, these people, especially who grew up here, were just shook. I was at work and this guy, he's like, I'm not going to be served by this him, she, or whatever it is. Carson asked us to go to the Pride Parade. I felt like I don't need to go to a Pride Parade to show you that I support you. I learned from early age that it's not okay for me to be different. They almost killed me. It's no secret that no Pride is inclusive of trans women. It's important for the world to know that there are certain experiences that are particular to people in one community. We still have so far to go. Pride is both a party and the protest. The world is ever changing. The world is ever evolving. This is my mom's first pride. And everyone should just be with the pride party. As long as LGBTQ people are facing any form of discrimination, pride is still relevant. People have been doing this for a long time. We owe it to our elders that we get to be here today. Welcome to the family. Happy Pride, everybody! People could clock I was gay from, you know, as early as I could well, walk on the... I mean, look at you. <laughs> <laughs> look at... Stop.